Alrighty fellas, the Iron Chessy here. I'm back for another LEGO Marvel 2023 set news video for you guys. And this time, I'm going to show you guys a brand new set leak for the lineup. And that is the official set image of the new LEGO Marvel 2023 polybag set. So this one, I heard about. This one is called Doctor Strange's Interdimensional Portal. This is at 30652. It is 6 plus. It has 44 pieces in one minifigure. And this set will cost... 5 US dollars here in North America and around the world for the lineup and this set will be in stock on February 1st, 2023 which is next month. So this is a good set and I honestly like it. So I've seen the picture since yesterday since they leaked this and the Disney one yesterday. So yeah, I wanted to see how this set looks like since I heard rumors about it, but this is so freaking awesome. So this is based off of the 2016 Doctor Strange movie. Yeah, Marvel Studios Doctor Strange. Well, not the Multiverse of Madness movie from last year, the 2016 film, since this is based off of the Marvel Studios Infinity Saga lineup. So anyways, I like to build up the set. And we do get Doctor Strange in this set right here. That version of him is the same one that we've gotten from last year. So... The one in the Garganto set from the Multiverse of Madness movie from the last January wave. And also the last year's Sanctum D2C set from last summer. So the face, torso, hip, and leg pretty are 100% the same. And so is the cloak and the hair piece. Well, I don't have anything else to say about it. The figure is still 100% the same. And they gave him those orange disc pieces as his powers right here. So that is really nice. So I don't have anything else to say right here. Just want to go quick on him a little bit because that figure is 100% the same. Well, they could just add his No Way Home look right here from the Spider-Man No Way Home Sanctum Workshop from 2021. They could just throw that version in the set instead of reusing the Multiverse of Madness version because that is his Phase 4 version. Yeah, his Phase 4 look and they could just add his old Infinity Saga suit right here in the set. And also, I love the portal build of the set. This is a nice looking build right here. I like that little potion right there on the bottom right corner that has a transparent purple minifigure head with no printing on it. So, yeah, that is really nice. And I really love how that turns out right there. So, we have those same transparent orange pieces right here from the D2Z Sanctum set from last year. And I like the background right here that we have New York right here. So, maybe they're... We're doing like that battle scene in New York and that Doctor Strange movie between him, Mordo, Kaecilius, and some of the other characters in that movie. So yeah, that is really nice. I tell you like the brick built buildings right here. So that is really good Look, I like the brick built buildings right here. So that is really nice. I like the rest of the artwork right here for the polybag itself. Like we have some other areas for the other floor of the Sanctum Sanctorum. So that is pretty cool key. So I totally like that how it turns out right here. So maybe like it's from the sea when Doctor Strange returns to the Sanctum after he sees Christine right here since he was being fixed by Christine after he was being stabbed. So yeah, that is really nice. I really like the build of this set. So the build, yeah, I like those transparent orange pieces and those brick build buildings right there that represent some of the buildings in New York so that is really nice so I totally like how that turns out right here well maybe some parts of New York or that other buildings from the final battle at Hong Kong so yeah that is really nice I totally like how that turns out right there for this lovely set right here so this is so freaking amazing right here so hopefully I'll get a chance to get this set right here well I already have the Multiverse of Man is Strange right here. Well, at least the build of the set is still cool looking. So I totally love this build right here, which is so outstanding to me in my opinion. I like how we do get the micro scale look at the buildings, the New York City buildings right there. And I like that transparent orange pieces representing the portal right here. So it is well done. For five bucks, this is a nice deal right here. And at least this is the cheapest way to get the Phase 4 version of Strange, but again, I wish they added his other version from the No Way Home Sanctum Workshop set that released in two years ago. So yeah, this is a really good looking set right here. Well, hopefully I'll get a chance to get this set if it's like showing up on the Amazon app or Lego stores or probably Target, but 
We'll see. We'll see how that turns out right here. Well, again, I already got that Doctor Strange minifigure because that look of him showed up last year from the two different sets right here. So anyways, this is still a good set. Well, I honestly love it. So this is based off of the 2016 Doctor Strange movie because this is part of the MCU's Infinity Saga lineup. So yeah, this is really nice looking and this is totally perfect. For five bucks, this is a nice looking set with a really awesome build and one minifigure for 44 pieces. So yeah, this is really awesome. I totally loved it this set right here and everyone's going to be a fan of it so this is going to be very nice looking and it is freaking awesome right there for the lineup so nothing much to say but that's all i've gone so far for the lineup so that is it for now thank you guys for watching remember to hit that like button don't forget to subscribe and make sure you're new hit that notification bell the z button and don't forget to hulk smash that comment section down below and tell me in the comments what you guys think about this polybag set for the lineup i'll see you later alligator